My favorite tacos made with fresh masa, cecina, which is a thin cured beef, and a few other goodies. I have my guacamole going with some onion, jalapeno peppers, a spoon of coconut oil to start frying the meat. Cecina meat can be salty. Keep that in mind when salting your dishes. Add onion, cilantro, fresh chile, a bit of salt, and in this case, I will use my own method of squeezing in an avocado. Make a few vertical and horizontal cuts on your avocado. Squeeze it in as you would an orange. It's really cool, it comes out mashed a little bit already. Add a pinch of salt. Mash it up all nice and beautifully. Look at that. Check up on your meat. It tends to cook really fast. The flame has been set on medium high. Add some onions to chard. Finally, chop cilantro and green onion for your pico de gallo or salsa. Don't forget about your meat and onions. Flip those babies around. Chop your tomatoes into finely diced cubes. This time around, I will use some habanero to spice up my pico de gallo. I made these fresh masa tortillas yesterday and yay, they're still soft. That's what we're always looking for. <laughs> but they don't always come out like that, you guys know that. It's so convenient to have them there ready and just warm them up. Check out my other videos so that you can see how I make these moist handmade tortillas. Cut your meat against the grain in thin strips. Have fun building your tacos and then eating them. I know I will. I also like to add a little bit of lemon. Mmm, they're so good. <laughs> the only bad thing is that Tomorrow, I'm going to want more. <laughs> Sorry. If you love pumpkin seeds, add this. Check out my other videos. I'll show you how to make it. It's so good. It makes your tacos even more unique. I, I haven't seen anyone else who does this. I got this idea from... Ancient cooking of Mesoamerica, which is the roots of Mexican cooking. Remember that when the food is this good, all you need is one dish. Thanks for watching. Love you all. And like I always say, tantos tacos ricos y tan corta que es la vida. Ay, no. <laughs> Oh well, translates to so many delicious tacos and life is so short. Boo hoo hoo. <laughs>